This is Dave at TitleSearch.com and AFX Title. What should you expect the first time you order a title search from a certified examiner? The first thing you're going to get is what's called a certified title abstract. That is the title document that gives you a breakdown of what the property status looks like. It'll have the deed information mortgages. Most important to most people, it'll have liens and it'll have judgments. If you've done title searches yourself in the past, this is not a document you've seen before. This is not a public records document, not something you'll find in the land records office. It's only available when you order a title search from a certified title abstractor. Uh, the title abstractor you speak to will most likely ask you about your use for the search prior to performing the title search. The reason why is that there's many different types of forms and presentations that you can get for that title abstract. You want to make sure it matches your use, especially if it's for a third party like a mortgage company or an attorney. Ask your title searcher questions about how they're going to perform the search. Make sure it has all the items that you need on your title abstract, the lien information, mortgages, maybe mortgage assignments would be important to you. Um, if you're looking to get a title search for some important or critical use on the property, uh, if you don't do title searching for a living, don't experiment on yourself by getting the title search done that way. If you are a foreclosure investor and you're looking at properties either through a sheriff sale or f through a bank sale, um, make sure that you're doing your due diligence on the properties. We also recommend that until you have a few thousand dollars saved up for a business startup, uh, wait to actually buy properties. Now, you may have a source of funding for buying the properties, uh, but if you don't have an extra few thousand dollars for an attorney to give you some good legal advice, maybe an accountant to give you tax advice and other miscellaneous fees, along with getting a couple um, well done and correct title searches, uh, it's probably best to hold off until you can have that business startup money available. So when you're getting a title search, make sure that you the first time you get that certified title abstract document that you have somebody that you can talk to to go through it with you, explain the liens, explain the mortgages, look at judgments, are there easements, and explain that to you as a potential buyer of that property uh, or if you're going to make some investment to know what your rights are.